Why, hello there! I am Mad Lord Dolphin, and this is Let's Play Wive and Keep, the Temple of the Lost Idol. Now available on Dezura. It's a nice little indie game. Always good to support independent de developers. So I'm going to start a new game, because I was having some problems with my uh, recording software. Normal game. How to play, I know how to play. Finally, we're here! Yeah, finally. I've had to pee for like 12 hours. Lucky for you, we're in the jungle! Bushes are abound and the rivers run loudly. A paradise for the woodland squatter. Har har. So, what's so special about this place? It's legendary! And, so is your ego. Well, so is your vanity. But, that aside, rumor speaks of a great treasure hidden deep within the temple. It better be more than a rumor. You spent all of our stash on this stupid plane, you bonehead. Ha! A simple investment for our great expedition. To the middle of nowhere in a jungle full of creepy crawlies. Creepy crawlies indeed. Mind your skirt. Onwards, keep adventure awaits. Hey, leg up. Oh ho, what do I spy? Treasure to the non-believers above us. A single gold coin. We might as well have stolen candy from a baby. I only do it for the challenge. Infants possess remarkable strength. Right. This may be a single gold coin, but I'd wager a single gold coin that there's more where this came from. Good, because that's all the money we have. Let's go, the flies are swarming. Then you shouldn't wear Oda Carcass perfume next trip. Yay! Alright, so, move here, and you have control of both characters like this. You can use, you know, WASD to control both characters at the same time. Or you can press shift to switch between which is controlled by primary, which is controlled by secondary. I'll be doing a mix of both. And I'll restart to get that last treasure here. And I'll restart again. And I'll restart again. God damn it! There we go. All right. All right. And we get all the treasure. And we go to the door. And boom. Just like that. Shazam. We have finished the level. Wasn't that fun, folks? Well, that was fun. I think that was pretty fun. Retries 3. That was shit. And they're not afraid to tell us that. Mind your head. Hey, Keep. I found you some toilet paper. Out here? What are you talking about? Yeah, it's a little old, and it has that weird kind of print on it, but it'll do it in a pinch. Print? Like words? Or what does it say? Um, it says, How marvelous a wooden box. I have discovered several of these oddities. Their origins are being a mystery to me, but there is no questioning their usefulness. By pushing them into position, I have been able to reach new heights, allowing passage through the treacherous ruin. You dimwit, that isn't toilet paper. That's a journal entry. Is it? Well, what's it doing out here? A lot more than toilet paper would be. All the same, give it here. So, boom. We move. Keep out of the way. Your wife push that down there. And now, look, we can about both come up here. So that wife is more keep, and boom! Just like that. So, this is mostly a blind playthrough. Um, I, again, did uh, do, like, up to 2-4 um, on another save. But I started anew, and, you know what? Another journal. Looks like a trend. Now, now, keep not everything as trendy or hip or cool. I said it looks like a trend. Oh, forget it. It says, the mystery grows deeper. I stumbled across the switch this morning. Standing on it had no effect. My withered bones just weren't heavy enough. But then a bulb was set to light in my head. After some finagling, I managed to box, box upon the switch, and as it meant to be, the switch depressed. A sudden rattle emerged from a nearby bush, and I discovered a trap board, trapped door had opened. I will have to keep a lookout for these shortcuts. They will, undoubt they will undoubtedly save me hours of travel. Hey, what does all that mean? Were you even paying attention? I fade in and out. 
So, yeah, basically. I haven't quite figured out how to get over there. Maybe it has to do with getting both these guys over here. Okay, so you can't jump. You can't jump off of something that's already So, that's straight out. Building 101. So basically, these things float. Boxes float on water. Who would have thought such a simple contraction could be so practical? Oh, that was short. That, that was short, so we're supposed to push boxes into water now? If you want to cross this river, yes. Why? You're chubby. You float, don't you? Get pushing, or we're going to find out how well you sink. Yeah, I don't... Runoff perils. Okay, there was a trick to this one. Well, I mean, there's tricks to all of them. But it was something like...
Foggy Nook. Amusingly enough, one of the befuddling boxes had become ensnared in an ancient weave of some sort. It was hoisted high into the jungle into the jungle ow, just my tongue. Into the jungle canopy, anchored by a neighboring tree. The box seemed sturdy enough, as I could safely mount it to observe the unique avian life of the Amazonia. Hey, Cape, what are avians? Birds. This guy has studied birds? Ha! What a nerd! Hmm. When my studies were concluded, I slashed the twine suspending the box, allowing me to use it as any other of its mysterious kin. Well, you better climb up there and get it. Wait, why me? You're more simian than I am. What? You're not going to tell me what simian means, are you? that up. nearly the end of the good doctor. It was seen the, nat the natives have a dark side. Mechanisms embedded into the walls shoot poisoned arrows over timed intervals. The ever-present wooden box saved me, blocking the booby trap, but blah blah blah. Why do I keep having to read these things? They're boring! You keep picking them up. Stop and you won't have to. You pick them up then. I don't wanna. Stop being a baby.
Out of the pan. Into the fire. Oh, hey, I figured out how who wrote all these goofy letters. It says here, his name is Arthur P. Circumstance. Arthur P. Circumstance? And who is he? It says, Dr. Arthur P. Circumstance logging his historic expedition into the previously uncharted temple of the now extinct Zuhurl tribe. Isn't that the name of one of your stupid dogs? Cuddles is a Z Zoloid's Quintley, and he isn't stupid. The natives of these islands bear... Ugh, the, <laughs> the natives of these lands fear this place. They refer to it as the Temple of the Golden Idol, a revered icon of the Zoo Huddle. They say these woods are cursed by its very presence and refuse to accompany me on my voyage. This is this made trekking through the dense jungles of Amazonia slow and overwhelming. Strange boxes, switches, and a nincompoop have been slowing down ours. But as I now gaze upon the temple's astonishing ruins, I am assured of my purpose. Over the next few days, I hope to explore this fantastic archaeological find, bringing light to the little-known Zohrul. Yay. So, this one was a little bit of a bitch to solve. Suffice to say, push this guy all the way this way. And send right here. Push all three boxes down. That. And he moves. And you finish pushing. And I'm a retard. Right, because when I pushed the three down, Y was actually going supposed to take the place of that one box I pushed down instead. So, like that, and like this. That I guess. The entrance to the temple at long last. It would have been faster if someone had remembered his notes. I swear I packed them. Somehow they seem to have disappeared. No matter, after we traverse this pitfall, the treasures of an entire kingdom will be ours. And how, per se, do you intend on traversing it? Good intentions? With my trusty robe, of course. Let's just let me find it. Everything going okay? Of course! What I meant to say is with the sturdy greenery by which we now find ourselves surrounded. I am not clambering down into the dark on some slimy creeper. It will not be dark when I ignite my trusty lantern. No lantern? Supplies seem short, but do not be discouraged. Keep for intuition shall guide us. Mine, I hope. I hope too. So. I'm going to cut it off here for now. Uh, we're at level 2-1. I haven't made it far, pretty far past this, uh, but I will continue this later. Uh, until that later time, or later date, I am Mad Lord Dolphin, and this is Let's Play Wive and Keep. See you next time.